Hello everyone and welcome back to Kayla's Kitchen. Today we are doing another holiday tea review from the David's Tea 12 Teas of Christmas. So this was of course a little holiday sampler pack that I got in my recent order, which you can watch the haul up there if you want to. I don't know, you don't have to, but you could if you wanted to. Today we are going to be taking a look at Winter Earl Grey. So Winter Earl Grey was released in the first part of their holiday collection launch, which launched about a week ago. Um, a little bit longer if you were a Frequent Steeper because Frequent Steepers got early access. Um, but I think for everyone it launched about a week ago. And as of right now, this tea is sold out on the website. This is one of the few teas that was like new that was released in both the holiday sampler and online to buy ounce by ounce. There were a couple of other teas that they released only in the sample pack, so hopefully those will get released to buy ounce by ounce soon as well. But anyway, let's take a look at the description of this tea. So David's Tea says, this holiday season we could use a little something to look forward to. Get ready for a year-end glow up in the form of tea, winter Earl Grey. We've taken our classic citrusy and malty bergamot black tea and decked it out in red peppercorns and silver white tea. The result is creamy and fruity flavor with a sophisticated twist. Happy sipping. Oh, they stole that from me. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> so let's take a look at the ingredients and what the tea looks like. The ingredients in this tea are black tea, pink pepper, white tea, natural cream and vanilla flavoring, cornflower petals, bergamot oil, and natural orange flavoring. This tea smells wonderfully of orange. Yeah, you get a really nice, strong bergamot and citrusy orange from there. It smells so good. It smells nice and sweet and super citrusy. Yeah. So I have my tea steeped up here. I did one perfect spoon in this mug at uh, 200 degrees for three minutes. That's really nice. It's really creamy and you get a nice, I don't know if I would call it sharp because it's not overwhelmingly citrus, but you do get like a, a like ping of that bergamot in there. I'm not sure that I can necessarily taste those peppercorns at all. But it's just a nice, creamy, citrusy Earl Grey. I don't think that there's anything necessarily super special about this one. I mean, it looks really festive. It is a fun tea to have for the holiday season, but I wouldn't necessarily say that this is like the, you know, new best Earl Grey or anything like that. It does have a pretty unique flavor because of the addition of the white tea in there. So it is, it's not just like a, a malty black tea because it also has those really nice light silver, silver needle white tea leaves in there. And I think that that does elevate this tea because it's not just an Earl Grey, it is different. It's not necessarily the strongest tea ever. So the, Earl, the, the citrus in here isn't super strong, but it is, it is really good though. Like it's actually, I, I enjoy it, but I'm not necessarily sure that this is something that is like super new. And I do like that they released just like a, a plain Earl Grey though, because sometimes you, you just want something that's a little bit more simple. Like these teas can be really rich and decadent and, and going between like just these really sweet, strong flavors. So having just a nice light Earl Grey is just kind of nice. And it definitely does feel very Christmassy. I don't know if that makes sense. So overall, the flavors that I'm getting are cream, vanilla, a little bit of citrus. I think that the cream and vanilla are definitely more dominant than the citrus, but they are all there. Not tasting any peppercorn. The white tea is really elevating the black tea and helping it become a, a lighter and smoother cup of tea. And it's just a nice cup of Earl Grey. It's not necessarily anything super duper special and new and different, but it is in terms of what it is, which is an Earl Grey, it's a very nice cup of Earl Grey. But like I was saying before, I kind of like that David's Tea has sort of gone a more like basic tea route because sometimes you get all of these like really new and unique and different teas and, and they're nice, but sometimes it's nice to just have a, a nice simple cup of tea. And I really appreciate that. 
as I said in the beginning, this tea has currently sold out on the US website, so hopefully it will be back in stock. I did also see, so today is Thursday, November 5th, and it is saying that there's like something is launching, uh, I think it's either tomorrow or Saturday. It was like one day and something, but I didn't look at the hours, so it could be Saturday, it could be tomorrow, I don't know. So it does look like they will be launching new stuff in their holiday collection. I don't know if that will include any of the teas from the sampler that they hadn't released yet. Maybe they'll be restocking some of their teas and hopefully they'll be releasing some teaware. But also even though it is Thursday today, this review isn't going up until Monday. So you guys will will already know what's up there by the time you see this. Anyway, that doesn't matter. So I'm not telling anybody unless you didn't know that they were doing that. And then maybe not, you know, who, who cares? Anyway, whatever. This will just be like a, a log to see how right or wrong I am about what I predicted this launch to be. <laughs> but that is my look at Winter Earl Grey from David's Tea. Have you tried this tea before? Let me know what your thoughts of it were in the comments down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and subscribe down below. I'm going to be posting three new reviews every week until like mid-December-ish for all of these holiday teas that are coming out. Plus every Wednesday and Friday I'll have a baking video up and just like a fun extra holiday themed video. So you totally want to see those, right? That is all for now. So as always, happy sipping.